Coming up on this week's show, we have a cosmic double drop as we unveil new albums from Baracho and Humulus. Welcome back, my friend. Welcome. Please take a seat as we descend into the heavy underground once again. That was You Walk, the latest single from Oralea, ahead of their new album, Thousand Petals, out on King Volume and Cosmic Artifacts on the 14th of July. Not long now, folks. Head over to the Cosmic Store and pre-order your copy today. And now, the news. Hi, I'm Dr. Alderson, and this is the Cosmic News. Well, Hellfest took place at the weekend there, hailing possibly one of the gnarliest lineups in the history of gnarly lineups. Luckily, if you weren't there, you can grab some absolutely superb coverage over on the Art Concert YouTube channel. A link will be below. Next, Baroness have unveiled a new song. announced their new album Stone out September 15th with a US tour beginning in October called The Sweet Oblivion Tour. And finally, Uncle Acid and the Deadbeats are to release their first ever live album, Slaughter on First Avenue, recorded at the same venue, First Avenue, Minneapolis, at two separate times in the band's career, once in 2019 and then again in 2022. Slaughter on First Avenue is as unique a live album as the band is itself. 14 killer tracks spanning 86 minutes Slaughter on First Avenue is out July 28th on Rise Above Records. Back to you, Elder. Hey, Dirk. I'm sorry about last week. I was just wondering, man. Have you had a good week? Yes, I've had a good week. Ah, shut up. Ah, uh, yes, I have been watching the Hellfest highlights myself. I must say, take a look at June's performance. From the depths of the heavy underground in Scotland, Signed to Metal Blade Records. This is a band on a cosmic trajectory that showed no signs of slowing down. But just take a look at this and tell me, is this a band on the cusp of greatness? Let me know in the comments below. We have a few announcements of our own to make here at Cosmic this week. We have two new albums from two Cosmic bands that seem to be on our unstoppable creative streak at the moment. First up, and appearing at Maryland Doom Festival this very weekend, Baracho have just announced their next album, Blurring the Lines of Reality out August 18th on Cosmic Artifacts. The Washington-based rockers penned this new record during the global pandemic. So naturally, the album carries with it a sense of impending doom intertwined with social-political topics and references. Baracho have pulled sounds and influences from every direction creating a tapestry of sound that simply crushes. 
having also just released a new single, Architects of Chaos Eye, created by the future overlords of Earth. But you, what? You mean they're not ready for that? Too early, it's too late for that. Sorry, I mean created by AI. Yes, the album cover and video were created by AI. A nod back to the album's themes, demonstrating the potential benefits and dangers of this newfound technology. Check it out. Now, ahead of their appearance at this year's Keep It Low Festival in Germany this October, our Italian psych rockers Shumulus have also just announced their brand new album Flower of Death out September 1st on Cosmic Artifacts. Another record born out of the stagnancy of the pandemic. Flower of Death sees Shumulus recharged and ready to destroy. The band were accompanied by Stefan Koblek. You may recognize the name from a certain color haze. Coglick helped during the composition phase of writing this album and lends his axe work on the track Seventh Sun. I have of course already had both albums blasting throughout the castle, shaking the very foundation. And I can confirm these are two records that you will want to get your hands on. Now, before we go, it is of course time for... The Riff of the Week! This week's Riff of the Week simply must be Paracho and their new single, Architects of I. Until next week, my friends, keep it loud, keep it heavy, keep it cosmic. Budget's